Hello people, welcome to part 94 of right, this part, bit of training and then enter the wind cup and see what happens. So I've not actually uploaded something for like, I think it's a few days, I've been watching um, E3. It's been pretty good, it's, it's been quite good, it's, it's been pretty good, it's been quite a solid year for E3. So just, literally this morning I've watched Xbox, the Sony one, uh, the Ubisoft one, and the PC gaming one all together. I don't think the Sony uh, E3 was very. I, I, was, I, I was hyped for the Sony uh, E3 event, and it let me down. I actually think Xbox won. Like the Xbox conference was much better. I watched about five, six minutes in the PlayStation One. I was bored. With the Xbox One, I watched like twenty minutes, and I wanted to watch more, but I actually fell asleep because it was on at like eleven o'clock at night. So I had to then go on the internet, and I think I think the Xbox One was more interesting. The Sony One was just boring. The Sony was a lot better last year. Because it, it had like the it had like the PlayStation 4 Pro. <coughs> I don't know why I'm talking about Xbox on PlayStation. Whilst I'm actually doing a video, but never mind. There you go, right. I better go and rest him now. He's done it for four hours of training. What techniques has he got then? He's got Promise Beam, that's pretty good. Bug's pretty good and he's got that. That uses a lot of MP though. So does that. That's not bad, 102. Because I think they go in preference, so who use Bug the most now, which is what you want. Because Bug will just like destroy anybody. I pretty much always said you need Bug to win a tournament, and I think... But it does use a lot of MP, but I think if you had Bug, and then you had like Spitfire, or something like that. Just Spitfire to stop them from attacking, like, I think you need both. Like Spitfire stops them from attacking and it's fast so you don't use much MP and then Bulk will just take out all their HP. Then you probably want like a confusion technique as well. So you have a bit of everything. So you confuse them, use Bulk, once they're not confused, hit Spitfire so they can't like hit you. But yeah. I think PlayStation didn't have any big titles. The Last of Us 2 we kind of expected. We want much really. Plus the PlayStation 4 Pro is like 350 It's 350 quid. In, 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 I think in America it's 399 dollars. In England it's 350 quid. And then the PlayStation, then the Xbox, um, the Xbox One X is 450 quid, which is quite a lot, 450 quid is a lot, I think. But everyone's like, oh, you know, Microsoft have shot themselves in the foot, but I don't know, it's going to be interesting to see. 
I think if they had to put it as £400, then it would be game on. It would only be a £50 difference and people would pay it because it would be like... Because you can use your Xbox with, like, you can link your Xbox to Windows 10 and it's got backwards compatibility and it's got um, 4K, like, slash Blu-ray. So that alone is probably worth 50 quid extra. So if it was 50 quid more, the Xbox, people would definitely buy it. I don't know if it's worth £100 more. It's quite a lot to ask. Especially with Xbox Live, because you have to pay that, that's 40 quid. So that's 140 quid, that's quite a lot to ask. So, we'll have to see. We'll have to wait and see if people buy the Xbox One X or not. It's quite powerful anyway, this thing. How old is he though? 16. He's got 7000 HP, 4000 MP, 500 offense. 600 defense, 500 on speed. Brains is about the only stat what's a bit low. Everything else is alright. So you could basically say he's got 500 on every start. He's probably the strongest ultimate I've had. Like, ever. Because he's got 500, let's say, on every start. And he's got 6,000 HP. He's got 6,000 HP, which is about 2,000 more than everything else. And normally I have about three to 4,000 MP. So he's got, like, I got... He's got at least 300 more MP than everyone else. So I think this is probably the strongest ultimate I've ever had. I could deal with winning the cup, but if I don't, I don't. It'd be nice to win the cup, let's put it that way. But if I don't win it, I don't win it. I should win at least the first round, I think. <coughs> well, I hope so, anyway. Well, we know he can't digivolve again. It'll probably fade on like. I'm happy with his defense at 700, that'll be fine. You can't sleep now. Oh, I'll probably miss a damn tournament now. Because I bet it, it, I bet it'll wake, I bet it won't wake up in time. Oh, that's so annoying, I've got all the power. Might make it. I don't know how long it runs. I don't recognise it ran that late. Unless it runs till like midnight. It might run till midnight. Hurry up. I think it might be like 10 o'clock till 10 o'clock. Yeah, made it. Alright, I've got to win the the wing cup. I've tried before and I can't... I, I think I had Pixie one last time. Oh, I've got to fight Gigadrum on Info win this. Probably game over already. Eight Gigadramon. Gotta beat this stupid Angimon thing first, but... I'm quite happy with them stats. 700 defense especially. 
They've got 500 fast offenses only for I need to just blast them now. Just destroy them. That's the one. Go defensive! I've done loads of damage. I don't think he'll do that much damage. No, he's not. A little bit of damage, but 200's not that bad, I can tell you that. This is why I got my defense up. He'll probably use his special about 50 seconds onwards, but I don't have to just, like, beat him. I might try and just use my finisher. Even if he gets his finisher, I think. I don't want to run out of MP, that's the problem. Got it. Well, at least I won the first round. If I have to, I might have to, like, go explosive, then defend a lot. Because my defense is 700. His offense is only 400, you see, so I had a 300 deficit, uh, 300 surplus. I think that's why I didn't do much damage, because I had high defense and he had low offense, so he just couldn't touch me. 200 was about the most he did. So I need to train defense a lot. Like if I got like 800 defense, I could probably just sit there and defend all day. Because they just won't be able to hurt me. They will have high offense, but probably low defense. Yeah. So now I need to go the opposite way. I need to attack a lot. Oh, oh no, he didn't. I thought, I thought I didn't. I thought he got away with it for a minute. Don't eat- oh, what are you doing? Go defensive! I've done like 2,000 damage to him, I'm winning. So I just need to go defensive for a bit. He does 300 damage, so it's a bit stronger. Keep your distance, man. I need to build a bit of time here. Ah! Still winning. Get up! You meant to be like 500 speed. Use it. Oh, it's being clever now. Oh, he blocks a lot of them. I'll get my finisher in a bit anyway, so I'm not too worried. It'll do quite a bit, but... No, you fucking don't. Oh, he did. Right, get him. I think I'm winning. I can't remember who had more life. It's bloody close. Yes, I won! Don't need air free. Oh, God, for that thought, I'd throw for a minute. I won by 600. That was a bit close, but never mind. It's my MP again. I hate Giga Drummond. It's so overpowered in this game. Or oh, is it Mega Drummond? It's Mega Drummond, isn't it? 
even with an absolute tank and clever management, I only just won. Um, he's only a champion in here, this bloke. I might win. I might have to go super aggressive and win. How much life does he have? Hmm. I might win this. We're about the same on life. Right. Attack him for... Whoa, what, what was that? That's like prominent speed. Use both. I'm going all in. Oh no. Right, go defensive, because at the moment he's done less damage than me. I should be able to block them. Now attack. Then go defensive. Ah! Uh, I'm at then. Yes. Stop his attack. Now it's all defense. I've just got to win. I basically got to hit my finisher. If I can hit my finisher, it's game over. It depends if I can hit my finisher. Damn it! That's what I didn't want. I'm a sitting duck. Ah, oh, bloody hell. This is going to be close. I don't think I can attack anyone. No, I can't. Things I might, hit my, might miss my finisher. It might just be me. Basically, run away because that burns time. Got him. It was a bit bloody close. It was very close, but I got him. I just about scraped a win in the W Cup. That was too close, though. It was hitting prominence beam what did it. I hit two prominence beams and I got 400 and 460 damage. It, that helped me win, that did. Ciampioni! Ciampioni! Thank God for that, I won the W Cup. It was still close though, I need more MP, I need a bit more defence probably. And I probably need a bit more speed. 5,000 bits! White wing? What the hell's a white wing? Oh yeah, did you go to Angie man? Oh, that's pretty good. Oh, that's well good. Oh yeah, El Cup as well. Come on, let's go. I'm in a good mood now. I was in a good mood before this because Age of Empires has been released on computer. Age of Empires the first one, HD remastered, and it, and you can play it in 4K. My God. I might just have to buy a, a, like, a bit of a better computer just to play Age of Empires in 4K, that would be a beast. But the voice said really I don't need it, like, I, I could do with a bit uh, with a computer upgrade but not a new computer, but really to play Age of Empires you, you might need a new computer. Plus, thingy, Warhammer, Warhammer 2's coming out. I've not played the first Warhammer but... Warhammer 2's coming out. I could really do with a better computer just to play all these lovely games, so... I think next year is going to be the, uh Saving up for a computer. I've not been able to do it this year because I'm only passed me... I've not passed me driving test that long ago, and, uh My car... I'm paying my car off at the moment, so... Hopefully, about May next year. My car's all paid off. So I'm hoping I can save some money. Because otherwise, if I've just paid it off and then it's, it, 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 it needs repair and I have to swap it and then I have to pay another again and I'm back to square one. And it might be another 18 months. I'm hoping not.
Anyway, I'm telling you a bit too much detail here. Why am I telling you all this shit? I don't know if I'd it after, after like resting because you had that horrible grueling battle. I don't know if you'd rest like you'd heal up enough. Yeah, 700 defense is beast though. He's 17 now though. So he'll go to sleep probably in the day and then I'll probably have to rush back and do it again. I'm not too fussed here now, I've won a cup. I've finally done it, I've won a W Cup. I only just won. You can't believe you need 7,000 life to win a W Cup, that's just stupid. It's not the life I needed, it was the MP I ran out of MP and because I ran out of MP I couldn't attack so I had to go defensive. He had about 2,500 life left, he had plenty of HP. 152 MP again. How much does Bug use anyway? 354. Quite a lot then. Prominence Beam only uses 180. Danger Sting uses 102, so at the moment I've got, I've basically got two Danger Stings. Four, five, six, four hundred I've gained, so I've got, I've gained one bug. One extra bug I've gained. I've gained one bug and one Danger Sting by doing all that training. That's it. That's all I've gained. It could make the difference though, because he only had 500, he had 500 HP last time, so it could make the difference. And I missed one of my bugs last time, so... Me actually, um... Having that extra MP could make the difference. I've not got any of his other stats up, I've just got his MP up so far. I think it'll probably say like, oh you can't, I don't know. It was day 28 wasn't it? Or whatever. He's not tired now. What's going on? You can't enter the cup yet, can you? I don't think. Or was it tomorrow's cup I entered? Oh, tournament's tomorrow. Oh, I should have gone in. Well, I should have gone in like an A cup then. I couldn't go in the L cup anyway. And the A cup's not really worth it. That means he's going to be age 18 when I win that cup, so he won't make the next cup. He's won the W cup though, so he's done one good thing. He's done the main thing. I need to win the L cup then, because I won't get a second chance. <coughs> so even if he only does that, that's two big cups out of the way. So that'll help. I should save and sleep, really. Surely I'll win though, because I've got that much power. I surely, I surely, I'm just going to go for it. I should just be able to blast them out. That's three anyway. 
I'll go and rest him then, I think, now. He's done three. He's not as young as he used to be. I'll just let him do three. He can have a bit of a rest. Yeah, I'd probably say he's fine, but I'd rather rest him and just play it safe. Gotta look after him now. He's getting on a bit. He'll be age 18 in a bit. He could even fade after, like... He could fade before the even tournament. I don't think he will. They all seem to die... Fade. They all seem to fade on day 19. First hour on day 19, they all seem to fade. I've never had anyone get further than that. He did, this guy did did evolve though, like, uh, as a rookie, like from an intro to a rookie quite late, so. I think what I'll do is I'll probably win the cup and then I think I'll end the part. Then I'll, on the next one I'll put, like, he fades. It's quite a big part though, because like I said, in the last couple of parts we've got Kuwagamon, I've got Hercules Garbutomon as well, they're, they're two big names. I mean, if there's another big cup, I could use the chain melon. I've still got it somewhere. And I think it gives you half a day longer, so it might just get you to the tournament. I think on one, I'll probably have to use all the fruits and, and the chain melon. And I'll have to get some digi, like fish things. to sleep? I don't know, I can't remember. I don't even pay much attention. I didn't get it, I can't remember. It's not full, are you? Nope. So yeah, so far it's been a good day, I mean you've got, we've had some big announcement this week, you've had Xbox, Xbox One, you've had Intel's range, AMD's Threadripper, Th Thread, Thread, Threadripper, Thread, yeah Threadripper, I think that's how you say it, Age of Empires is out, Last of Us 2, I can't actually believe I'm going to say this, but Call of Duty, WW2, which is like a World War game. That actually looks good. I am not a Call of Duty fan, and I do not like Call of Duty, but actually, I've got to say, this new Call of Duty game does actually look quite good. I might actually consider buying it, because I've got an Xbox One. I don't, I don't really use it, I might buy Call of Duty for it. I don't even like Call of Duty, it's just it looks good. It, it, it looks like the best one. The flamethrower thing looks funny. I can just burn people, that just looks funny. I must have a bad sense of humour. Burning people looks funny. No, don't actually, don't go burning people, it's not funny. Anyway, I'm talking about everything else. I should really make a video and like, just call it like, E3 or like, overview or something, like to make notes on it. Not much like, play Digimon and then like, talk about bullshit. Because it probably is a bit annoying for you lot, like, you expect me to talk about Digimon? Oh, that's one thing they didn't mention actually on Sony. There's no Digimon mention at all. Like, they didn't even mention it. Like, the, like Cyber Sleuth, I think, is having like an update and they didn't even mention it. I know it's like a big tar, but they could have like done it online or something. 
But no, that annoyed me a bit. I didn't. I know. I'm on my way. Five hundred eighty-nine for offence. That should be enough. Five eight nine. It's my defence. What's going to hold me? What's going to win or lose it for me? Being like, you know. You can just tell, can't you? In the other round, it was all defense what won it for me. I've got a bit more MP though this time. I've got about a, a thousand more, so I can I can hit like two more bugs and like a danger spike. So I should should me. Who am I fighting? Like an evil mode. These are called like champions. Oh, it's just the one where it, they're all champions, but they're all buffed up to so like ultimate levels. I think this might be the one. It looks easy and then once you get into the fight they're all buffed up. I've got 580 and 580 for the main two stats. What's he got? 400. I've got about 100 lead. Oh this will be a fucking easy battle. I hope. Use both. Oh wow, 900. Oh yeah, I've got this one. Stop attacking! Oh, I wasted a lot of MP there. Why is it? Uh, now. Oh, not again. None of them are going to hit, are they? I said go bloody defensive, man. Yes, that last one hit. Oh, that was so lucky. I wasted so much MP there, I should have got that done with about 4,000 MP left. Oh, you wasted too much MP on that one. It was an easy win, but wow, that was a bit of a waste. That will cost me in the final, that might cost me the final. Because he owes too many bugs. That needed to be like an easy quick win, two or three bugs, and wham. It started off beautifully, but it went downhill. Should be able to win. Oh yeah, win this and all. I just walked up to him and literally kicked him in the face. That was hilarious. How do you mean? Now go defense, don't attack at all, thank you. And I've got this one. Because he probably could attack me for a minute and he probably won't even do like, he probably won't even do 2000 damage. So I'm literally, I think to save MP I might just go defensive. What's he doing? He's running away. Oh, this actually helps me. Now I can use distance. Bollocks. I can't block now. Huh? I don't think he'll do enough damage anyway. Yeah, 
You meant it! Oh, fuck it. Go on defense. He's too close. Got him. We're about even, but with this, I think I'll win. Whoa, 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 what are you doing? I didn't, I didn't tell him, to, I, like, you saw that. I did not tell him to attack, and he just went for the blow. Hercules got me to him, I was like, you know what, screw this, I've had enough of defense. He's like, I'm just going to bug him. I didn't even tell him, oh. I didn't even tell him to do that, and he's just like, you know what, screw it, I'm winning this battle on my own. I think Hercules Carby Termon's getting a bit of an ego problem. He's like, no, I'm gonna bet I'm gonna bury I'm gonna bury up with me golf with his shovel. Bless him. Never mind, he won anyway, not bothered. Now tank one I've got no idea, he might be pretty good, but I thought they'd be a bit better than this. Not moaning, right? Use bug. Bug might not do a lot though, because he's a metal tank. Like, he's a tank made from metal, sorry. Oh, bloody hell. Defense, defense. Oh my days. I think with bug though, he's blocking a lot of them, like... If you've got bug and they haven't got very good defense, they won't block many of them. Now, why is he using prominent speed all the time? I think I got a double hit. There. Yeah, look, 900 uh, HP left. Boom, victory, I hope. Yeah, victory. Victory! I only just won, though, again. Really? His HP's ridiculous, so look how much HP he's got left. Not even, like, you can't even damage him. But he's consuming that much MP, it's ridiculous, like... They only had about 3,500 life. I know on the bug championship he has like 10,000 life. I think literally like all his stats are 800 and he has 10,000 life and 10,000 MP. The bug championship's like nearly impossible to win. 5,000 bits, yes. Oh, you died! That was so lucky that I got that done then. Wow, that was lucky. I was just saying he'll probably fade away, and he did. At least I won two big cups with them, or a W cup and an L cup. That they were big, big victories. I needed both of them. Um, bollocks. That's bad though, because I was going to get. I was gonna go to the. Uh... That's probably because I trained him to death. Oh man. Go for the first one. Because <coughs> Argumon's got loads of Digimon he needs to evolve into, so I'm going to have to probably use an Arg. Probably going to have to do this. Yeah, I'll change. I'll. Oh, I didn't say his stats on the battle system. Damn it! What should I call him? I might just call him Red. Just gonna call him. I can't be bothered to actually think of a proper name, so Red will do. 
Which is actually quite ironic because Red is actually a name of a Pokemon trainer. I just thought, so I've just named a Digimon after a Pokemon character. Never mind, I didn't think about that. Too late now. I don't know how to rechange names on this game either. So, Red better be good because if not, a lot of a lot of Pokemon fans might be pissed at me. So I'm gonna have to make Red pretty good. Thing is, he, he had about 7,000 HP. Look, yeah, look, 821. Because his stats were t good, he ke he gets good stats to start with. So it must be like a percent. It must be about five percent he gets. If you had a, a Digimon at 9999, then you'd probably get like really good stats. 112 and all on HP. Bloody hell! And he's not even done anything. Oh, I got the red ruby on the other one. Oh, beast of a prize. You know what, I'm going to give them a super character. Because these don't... You might as well, because at the beginning, they don't seem to care what they eat. They don't get, like, re-hungry or anything. Like, they just eat whatever. So you might as well use it and give them super cards, and they don't seem to matter if they lose weight. They don't really get any hungrier. They do when they're like champions and like when they're rookies and stuff, but this early on they don't seem to really give a damn. I don't actually know if you like what happens if you do a care mistake with an in training. I don't know if it like affects them. Like, if you just fed him something, like, a super carrot, and then you did feed him again to the, like, Dizzy or Rookie. I don't know if it matters. Give him a meat. I'll give him a meat this time. You went to sleep a minute ago. What's going on? Oh, I bet he went to sleep because he was tired. Let me go and rest him, because I bet he was tired, so he wanted to sleep, and then I fed him, so he's not, his bar, his tiredness bar, is probably gone below where he needs to be. So I bet if I rest him, he'll be a bit tired. If I, yeah, I don't know, I'll well, go and have a look. I'm a bit upset though. Yeah, a bit tired. Told you. It must lower their fatigue. It, I wonder if it lowers like how long they can go. Like super go makes you have to get a better performance, but you can't train as long. So instead of having like four train sessions, you can only have three. So it improves your performance, but you can't have as many train sessions, and you have to sleep more. So it might not even be worth it. Really. I think a radish doesn't because it adds weight on. It must have some side effect, but I don't know what it is. Because it adds weight. Maybe it shortens your life expectancy. But Ergenes got be time on didn't really have many um, like enhancement kind of things. So how much does he get then without any help? He might probably gets yeah he gets eleven. Thought he would. He had 107 offence. I don't think he'll gain any. He might go to about 112 if he, when he did evolve. Sometimes I do, sometimes I don't. I need him to sleep so I can save the damn thing. Because I think I started this about 10 past 11. So it's done, this video is about 50 minutes long, I'm sure it is. So I don't want to go too much longer. I'll store those two items, I think, in a minute. Otherwise I'll forget I'll have them. If I ever lose a battle, I'll lose them.
Oh, I went and collected my meat for the day, I don't think I have, because he died, didn't he? He faded away. I keep saying he died, he didn't, he didn't die. This isn't like a shooting game. He faded away, sorry. One thing I think like, they could have done, actually, is when you fade away, like, if you want the same Digimon, again, and you pick the same egg, like, your stats should have been increased, like, more, for, like, a certain, just for, like, one certain thing. So if you, if you had Hercules Kaipi Chairman and needed, like, a high, def high, uh, HP, high defense and high speed because you had a good bond, if you had like a good bond with it you should get one stat a little bit higher automatically so if you want to get the same one again like directly afterwards you would you could because that's what happened on Digimon Data Squad like Marcus obviously had Argumon it went to chaos mode it faded and then because like, they had a good bond Argumon did evolve to Shine Greymon, like straight away. And then he got to the burst mode. I know I've kind of just ruined the whole story. Sorry guys, but you know. Never mind. I always forget to do spoiler alerts, man. Some people must be really annoyed. I just forget. I've got a bad memory. Right, okay. Anyway, moving on. So yeah, I would have thought like if you had like Argumon, like if you pick, if you had Argumon like loads of times on this game, like if you had Argumon like four times, because you've had Argumon four times, if you've only had like six partners and Argumon's been four of them, you've obviously got like a, a good bond, so you should have like a bond rating. I think on the new Digimon data, uh, the new Digimon World Next Door, do you have a bond? But the bond shouldn't be like... If you picked him six times in a row and did evolved every stage of him, you, your bond should automatically like go a bit higher. Because you've picked him a lot. Like, you should feel like appreciated kind of thing. It might be quite hard to draw him because each time he had a new egg, if you didn't pick him, your bond would go down. So it'd be quite hard to implement. I'll do one more, then I'll go and rest him. Because I've lost bloody count. This is what happens when you sit here talking. Oh, is he not tired yet? Come on, man. It was easy to either argue one or Gabby one. I've trained defence because I think you need defence for Argumon. I'm pretty sure you do. He's pretty happy anyway. <coughs> hey, I don't wanna... He might have faded because he did evolve late, I don't know. I thought he might have gone longer actually. Day 18 was a bit of a shame. I think it might be because he didn't fight much, so it was all training. Because I've done it before when it's all been training, they don't go out fighting much and like they only get to day 18. I think you need to go out and fight a bit to make them live longer. It's weight 10. And this can get some more meat. Yeah, because the plan was to win the two cups and then kind of go out fighting to, like, get him up a bit, slash, get some money. I mean, I did win 5,000 bits and 5,000 bits, so I won 10,000 bits, didn't I, in the actual tournaments. So I did get some money anyway. Yeah, because I got 21. So I've got about 1,000 bits to spend. The thing is you get 10% off with that. You should be able to come in and buy 99 of everything with a with an in-train Digimon, which would save a fortune, 10%, you know. 
Well, sometimes you spend like 200,000 bits, you know. 20,000 bits, boom, done. Why'd they put that boing, 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 boing noise in? So annoying. I know it's like a dizzy one, it's realistic, but... It's a bit annoying as well. Hey, how they freaking leave you? Oh, I forgot to drop my stuff off at Argon Shop again. Right, I'm gonna end it this part, so the next part, it's gonna be me probably getting Argumon. But I've only got Greymon and Centurimon, so there's four people. I think once I get an uh, Argumon, I might go for someone like M Monochromon. Because there's Monochromon, there's Mirrormon, there's Tyranomon. I know how to get Tyranomon, Tyranomon's just HP and D. It's HP and Defense for Tyranomon. Defense and Weight for Monochromon. I think it's Offense and Fighting for Mirrormon. Who's the other one? Who is the other one? She got Greymon, I think Greymon is the orange one. Tyranimon's the reddish line. Merrimon, I think, is the purple line. Monochromon's like the purple line. Merrimon's like the one next to Centurimon. Who's the hell's the other one? Oh, Bergeron. Is it Bergeron? Bergeron speed. I mean, I could get Bergeron and, and then. I've got him as well, but if I get Bergemon, that means when I get Beomon, I've got only a 1 in 5 chance of getting the right thing. Which is a bit risky. So I don't think I'll get Bergemon with Argumon. I think I might get Bergemon with Beomon. It's probably a bit easier. But I think the other one for Beomon was... Oh, bloody hell. It's not Carbuterimon, is it? But he's got Carbuterimon, he's got Bait Bank on Carbuterimon, and then he's got Jumping Out. <sighs> My memory's going! Oh, this is embarrassing, hold on. Because I need to get Nannymon as well. Somebody has Shellmon, don't they, as well? I think it might be him, he's got Waymon and Shellmon. So I know, I know what Beatamons all are. Because to get Waymon, it's intelligence, it's brain. Palmon, you need uh, Carbuterimon, and nothing Waymon. So if I get Waymon, uh, it's going to put in a big gap. It will it'll fill in two slots. Bergemon fills in two slots and all. Electmon's out of the way and done. Pa Patamon's nearly done and all. Paramon's only got one left, I don't know who it is. But Paramon's nearly done. It's starting to get there now. Anyway, I'm rambling on again. Let me save this now. So the next part I think I'll get I'll get Argumon and I think I might get Monochrome on. So let me So that's it for this part. The next part I think I'll go for Argumon slash Monochrome on, I think. See you for that.